details about four-year-old Jordan Arndt's injuries revealed in court today after she was mauled to death by 26-year-old Jenna Wright's dog back in 2013. Wright was babysitting Jordan at the time. She is now facing 35 years in prison. KCCI's Kim St. Ange was in the courtroom today. She's live in Newton where day two of the trial has just wrapped up. Stacy and Steve, for the very first time today, we heard from Jenna Wright on that day of the fatal attack. I do want to warn you that some of what you're about to hear you might find disturbing. My daughter came inside. That's Jenna Wright, you hear, speaking to former Prairie City Police Chief Lewis Maudlin just minutes after her dog mauled four year old Jordan Arndt. Never shown aggression, aggression like that. This is audio from the now Altoona police officer's body camera and video from his dash camera. Wright said she was inside doing laundry when it happened. I literally said, Go tell the girls to come inside in 10 minutes. Maudlin told the jury Wright told him she walked outside and saw Jordan and Brutus. His mouth. I saw a large pool of deep red blood on the ground and one of Jordan's boots was laying next to the pool of blood. And on closer examination, I saw blood spatter throughout the grass and on the side of the garage. When Jordan arrived at Mercy Medical Center an hour later, Mercy trauma surgeon Cass Franklin treated her and was able to get a pulse and blood pressure after another 20 minutes of CPR. Did you observe any signs of life as a practical matter? Uh, she had no signs of life. Franklin told the jury her injuries could have been from violent shaking of the neck and that Jordan's injuries were the worst dog bite injuries he had seen in his 37-year career. This would have taken uh, extensive surgery to repair it and uh, in my opinion she would have left, been left with uh, probably residual paralysis if not worse. And the uh, Polk County Medical Examiner, who you just heard from, actually determined that Jordan's official cause of death was multiple dog bites to the neck. And coming up tonight at 6, hear from the officer uh, who tells you what happened on the day he tried to arrest Jenna Wright. Live in Newton, Kim St. Ange, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.